Howdy guys, in today's video we're going to be looking at how to fill the top of your channel letters without needing too many extra supports to do that. And this will be for print up software. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, back in the program here. Now, let's say you wanted to print a top uh, base for this, but not a bottom, you want to keep it open. Then um, we can simply do that by going select your shape, you go to print, and then we make sure it's set under print settings to customer. And then we want to go to our actual shell, which I'm just going to zoom in here so you guys can see better. Shell, and we're going to go down till we see got your top and bottom thickness here we go top thickness and then you can choose either, either how many layers or how thick so let's say we make this one more and then click here wait for it to update there we go we've got our one more now what's going to happen is you can do it this way but the problem is once it gets to the center pieces because there's no support as you can see it's going to struggle and it's going to make most probably a mess of it and if you put supports you're going to have to first cut all of that out which is a lot of extra work so now the quick way to go about that is you can simply just invert your text, you can say, or rotate it. So I'm going to rotate it 180 degrees. So the P is showing the opposite way. Let me just try that again. There we go. But you will notice we still have a problem. It's still filling the top. So now if we print it and we flip it around, the bottom is going to be filled. So now what we want to do, we go back there to print setup. And then on the shell, I'm going to now change it. Let me zoom in for you guys. I'm going to make the top zero. And then we're going to go to the bottom thickness and make this one. Zoom out. And now you will see it fills the bottom. So now we don't need any extra supports because that is the support in many ways. And then once you're done printing that, then you can simply just flip your text around and then the top will be printed with a solid support, which is very handy um, to save you a lot of time and also the actual resources but yeah otherwise that is it on the actual how to fill your top more efficiently and meanwhile though if we head here to softwaretraining.co.za you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover and you can also isolate your search on the top right if you do not however find the training videos you're looking for just simply go here request a training video fill in the mini form and then we'll do our best to try and make that for you but otherwise thanks guys for watching and cheers